Hey guys, in this micro lecture, we are going to talk about the body's pH scale. Now, I'll be the first to admit this is one of the more trickier of the micro lectures that we've had in the series, um, but we need to talk a little bit about the pH scale because it really does underpin human life. Now, some of you may have already seen or heard about the pH scale, others may have not, and that's fine. Uh, but for this micro lecture, we are just going to talk about the pH scale and nothing else. And now, of course, this does relate to conditions such as acidosis and alkalosis, which are both life-threatening conditions. But let's start by talking just about the pH scale. Now, everything that we eat, every time we take something into our mouth and break it down and it goes into our body and it becomes made smaller and smaller and ends up, uh, the nutrients end up in the cells and gets floating around in the blood. Uh, every time we take a deep breath in and deep breath out and we just live our lives, every time we go to the toilet and excrete, all of these things are, uh, are altering the pH of our blood. So what do we mean by pH? It's a measurement of the amount of hydrogen in our blood. Now, if you've never seen or heard this before, and I'm, telling, I'm basically speaking another language, welcome to the world of medicine. So this is basically a measure of hydrogen ions. So just think about hydrogen. Now, blood has a pH value of 7.35 to 7.45. So if we were to take a look at this scale in front of us, you can see how zero is on the left, and there's a reason it's red. 14 is on the right. Now, anything that is zero is extremely acidic. Anything that is 14 is extremely alkaline and you don't wanna be in any of these areas. And if I can be completely honest, anything below 7.35, your body does not like that one bit, and you are at risk of um, catastrophic failures and death very quickly. Likewise, anything above 7.45, and your body does not like that either, that's moving in towards alkalosis. So anything below 7.35 is classed as an acidosis, anything above 7.35 is an alkalosis. Let's take a look at um, another image here. Now, what you can see here is a tip of, that's the scale, the scale that we've just used and twisted around so that it's now um, vertical. Here we have the seven, which is neutral. Anything in the middle is neutral. This gives you an idea of other things in your world that are acidic and alkaline. So as you can see, um, fish will die around about here fish reproduction affected around about five or four. Think about the actual on a human being, stomach acid is around 3.5 and lower. So that gives you an idea. Um, milk of magnesium, blah, 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 bacon soda. So it gives you an idea of the type of um, things in our world and how everything that we do and everything that we are is based around this pH scale. What I would suggest is that you now get your heads into the books and go away and do some reading, but be warned, it's highly scientific and you're gonna to need to watch lots and lots of YouTube clips, but eventually it will all come together nicely. My name's Sam Willis and I hope you've enjoyed this micro lecture. Thanks guys.